Welcome to our next tutorial and in this one we will import our doc character that we exported from Blender as FDX file to Unity to use it for Mechanim. You can see the export as FBX file. And I will export directly to the folder where we can use it in Unity 4. This is Unity 4.5 and the Mechanim tutorial. Here you can see the dog is already imported because we use the export folder here as the a project folder and all, also the color maps here and now we will use the normal map also in this folder and define it in unity as normal map Okay, then we drag and drop the dock of the resize to our view in Unity here. And you can see it's a little bit, yeah, it's dark because we didn't apply the use light probes for the character. So we have to select it and choose use light probes for the inner mesh also for the eyes here so that the mesh is lit in a good way and that looks better now now we change the rig to humanoid and when we press configure you can see the mesh with the rig and this looks valid we have green bones here and a, a good t-pose for the character And when you switch to muscles, you can test if your character behaves in the correct way when you change the orientation of the bones. Okay, I change the the the, the distance of the feet don't want them to be too near together okay. that's good Since we do not have animations, we can leave this option unchecked. And we can use a bumped diffuse and add the normal map for this material. Okay, now I add a rigged body 
and after that also a character controller all these are default components in unity and after that we will add a script which is also a part of the mechanism tutorial for animating the character this script will play the jump animation when we press the left mouse button we also need to add the animation controller this is also a part of this unity mechanism demo it is called layer and plays the walk cycle yep and this looks really good so waving and jumping yes really nice I will do some corrections for the feet. They're too near together. Pull it just a little bit outside. Yes, that's much better now. Well, that's it. That's the way you can import each FBX file with a humanoid armature to Unity. I hope you liked the tutorial. Please subscribe to our channel. Bye and till soon.